Hi, in this video we are going to see about Nifty intraday breakout ranges. By watching this video you will have some idea how to put the uh, breakout level so that you can have some idea how to after the breakout what are the things you need to do. For that this video will be very helpful for you. Those who are new to channel kindly select the subscribe button in the below video link and then select the ring bell. By selecting the ring bell you can have some the continuous update from the notifications of my videos. So you can be updated in market also. If you like the video kindly like the video and select the share buttons also by sharing it and click the uh, name of the channel NSE commodity trader you will go to the home page in home page you can view more videos like this uh, like a strategy videos and then indicators oriented in both Tamil and English languages by watching this you can have some more ideas. We are also taking more advanced trading strategy class and we are also providing levels for commodity also and if you want to know about it whatsapp or contact this number if you want to open a demand or trading account by click the link and uh, selecting the link you will the procedure will the follow nifty uh, how to say nifty finally formed an uh, biggest bullish candle in the last 10 years and then uh, the rally is finished at ended up up above 5.32 percentage it's not only for nifty sensex also backed up with five percentage like that so this thing uh, many of them will know right now because of that single uh, fm news like that uh, how to say the tax slash the tax slash is a major thing uh, many of them are wondering why a tax slash why a corporate tax slash is a big thing for a market why market is moving more because uh, she almost slashed the uh, tax for up to 10 percent like that so it will be like a gain for the companies uh, by uh, like it will the gain will increase up to 12 percent like that for many corporate companies so that only all the stocks are started to boost up all the stocks are gapped uh, moved sudden movement and spiked out and more stocks like uh, in indesin bank hdfc bank kotak bank and then uh, bank stocks also started to boost and then the stocks like britannia fmcg setups also boosted so much because they are all the uh, hugest taxpayers so uh, by announcement of this uh, tax reduction almost 10 percent their revenues are increasing 10 percent so their earning per share also increasing 10 percent so due to that they started to uh, they how to say their eps will get increased so that their peer ratio will get reduced so that they they can uh, earn more if they are earning more means they are going to produce more productions and then they give more, more uh, how to say they can have more money to give the dividends also you can also have some more dividends like that also there are so many good things will happen in the market due to those reasons only market are still in positive trend and uh, uh, monday also we are all expecting a huge positive trend only coming week from the coming week onwards the turnover has been started because as you can see in technical wise also uh, this big squeeze has been rolled out the market you can see in top range it uh, traded up to 11,180 many times up to one two three four times it came up and then started to coming down coming down coming down in baseline also nifty did a great job at supporting level of 160 760 like that 10,760 one two three times uh, after this is the crucial time also but nifty recovered very very hugely it will be like a 10 years uh, lifetime high like that so 10 years high it will be like 600 points rally so due to that nifty registered 10 years new high like that so last 10 years new high after uh, 2009 uh, now only this much rally has been happened we are in the history we made the we have seen the history like that we can say also proudly so coming week onwards the positive trend are going to start uh, from the next week we can uh, surely say uh, the positive trend will get to start like that uh, technical wise all breakout has been happened all indicators are started to showing it as a positive trend for from the next week onwards we can give more confirmation also if you want but right now is the perfect time for investment also so if you want to do any investment right now is the perfect time for investment so don't miss out the chance and do the investments also for uh, investments why i'm telling the right now is also a big question many of them are wondering all stocks are uh, traded up all stock came up uh, will it still come up like that or many of them have some doubts like that but still 
every all stocks in positive trend only still there will be a positive momentum even if you want to do a trade in short term also you can do the nifty stocks for short term and uh, get the profits like that okay okay let me tell you the monday's breakout level so you can have some basic idea of uh, what will happen like that monday also we can expect a huge positive trend only uh, if no other things like happened a lot like the week started with the saudi of drone dropping like that if things not started like that means we will be in big positive trend only uh, okay let's see uh, the trend of uh, the first level of breakout we need to see not the 11300 uh, 11300 uh, why i'm telling you is uh, okay let me check it out in uh, show it in weekly candle so you can have some i have only 300 and 400 300 and 400 11300 and 400 will be the here the 300 range the 11300 range will become uh, first level resistance uh, this is the first last week candle uh, that huge candle here this candle the first level breakout need to see at 11300 then the next level need to see as the uh, this will be the resistance to this uh, this will act as a uh, major thing 11382 400 uh, this you can see uh, market sometimes traded this range so you can uh, see here clearly 11400 this range so if the market breakout and uh, previous day friday is uh, high also you can see 381 so if market break down this 400 level means again the market level started to boost more up and then again go to the uptrend range uh, last time also market uh, after going up came up to 400 range after the 400 range market again started to boost to going to up so like that happened so right now also we are expecting if this 11400 breakout also happened means market will go to the again positive biases only so from the 300 onwards you can go for bullishness if the 400 got breakout means you can go for even more bullishness the market will be more bullishness you can buy more okay so this will be the resistance level for the day for the time and then uh, we need to check out for the resistance also resistance we check out we need to check out for the support level also the major support this will be 11200 to 11180 this 11200 to 180 you can say, sure, say for sure until the market hold this 11200 to 180 range the market will be in positive bias positive trend and market can came up every time if it touches 11200 if this level breakout means again the squeezing time will get start there will be a chance for that because it's it will uh, move like a spike and then uh, after the spike market again came to this squeezy levels of 11200 to 11600 so market need to hold out this 11200 because this 11000 range played market more and more and more number of times 11000 changed the market more number of times if it came again to 11,000 means the market will get uh, range bound range long like that sideways market will change this trend like that if market uses this upward breakout and it's not a spike means and the breakout also happened at 11,400 means the market will be on more bullishness you can expect more bullishness you can go far by okay we are also taking more advanced trading strategy class if you want to know about it whatsapp or contact this number in future if you want to know about uh, more videos like this means kindly subscribe my channel and select the ring bell if you want to open a yeah, dmat or trading account kindly select the link in below description the procedure will follow thank you